Dragapult VMAX Shining Fates Collection Box. That's what we're opening up today. I'm really, really excited for this one. If you guys missed the previous Shining Fates unboxing or opening, we did the Crobat VMAX one. So I'll leave it linked down below or a card pop up right now. And we are, of course, running the Shining Fates giveaway. All my Shining Fates videos and playlists will be linked down below. So make sure you watch and answer the common question of the day for a chance at some free Shining Fates booster packs. With that said, let's just do the common question of the day right now before we jump into the box. It is which Pokemon do you guys prefer? Do you prefer Dragapult VMAX or just Dragapult? Or do you prefer Crobat V or Crobat V Max? Let me know. In my opinion, I like Dragapult a little bit more. I, I said this before in the past. Dragapult kind of gives me Gengar vibes, and Gengar is one of my favorite first gen Pokemon. So I'm gonna go with Dragapult V Max. That's my my choice out of the two. But with that said, let's take a closer look at this box and show you guys what is actually included and take a little look at the packaging. It's really nice, just like the Crobat uh, V Max box. These, in my opinion, would look really cool. I was like a display piece. They're really shiny, really glossy. We'll show you guys everything inside in just a second. There's a coin, the jumbo cards, the promos, and then there's a look at the back. You guys can feel free to pause the video if you guys want to read what it says on the back right there. But without further ado, let's get into it. I want to say that these are the very first times we've actually seen shiny jumbo pokemon cards i'm really excited to do my jumbo pokemon card collection video for you guys so if that would interest you feel free to subscribe and check out that video let's take all the contents out so here is what is included in the dragapult v max shining fates collection you of course get a copy of dragapult v so dragapult v real nice real shiny looks like he's just chilling just vibing pretty kind of competitive card some people run these deck um but yeah i'll probably just throw this into my binder looks nicely yeah, a little thicker on the left side for centering uh, but not horrible not horrible by any means here's a look at the back no damage out of the box which is nice to see we also have a copy of dragapult v max as well kind of reminds me of like an elvis presley haircut right there kind of thing um but yeah we have two of the little dragapult minions beside him really cool card i love the fact that these shiny pokemon genuinely look like a shiny pokemon shiny gengar is literally a shade tint darker than regular gengar so this right here i appreciate them being a different color you know actual different colors so yeah here's a look at dragapult v max here's a look at the back and then we'll have a look at them just side by side real quick so you guys can enjoy enjoy seeing the art together i love this card this card is awesome this card is awesome all right here's the code card you of course get the two copies of the shiny pokemon in the online tcg and besides the uh besides those you also get a massive massive jumbo card of dragapult v max so let me just zoom not not zoom in zoom out we got dragapult v max right here in its jumbo form and for context so you guys can see the size comparison here it is side by side it's like four of these cards put together into one and the texture is the same just like the actual card so you can see like the details and everything it looks really really cool i love it i love like i just love seeing these jumbo cards i want them to release a shiny charizard v max one that would be so sick so i'll leave links to buy these in the description down below i usually leave links to ebay so if you guys want to check them out for market value you of course can in this set box, we have uh, we got seven packs of Shining Fates, and funnily enough, what the heck? They overdosed us with with Dragapult. Look, they gave us four, four the Dragapult hearts, and then one Charizard over there. So we got seven of these, and we also opened up a Blister Pack of Unbroken Bonds for this video too. So we got a Typhlosion here. This is a promo Typhlosion, which looks really, really amazing. I love him. Can't wait for Pokemon uh, Legends Arceus to come out. Cyndaquil is going to be my starter. We got three packs of Unbroken Bonds, which we're going to open up at some point in today's video. And one of you guys can take this code card for the Typhlosion in-game, because I've opened up a lot of those three-pack blisters. Oh yeah, I forgot you also get this right here. Well, that's probably a bad camera angle. This is a better camera angle. You got a Dragapult uh, coin. Really nice metallic look. Looks really, really cool for you Pokemon coin collectors out there. All right, enough chit chat. Pack time. Let's get into it. Let's do all the Dragapult first and let's see what we can get. 
Oh man, I can't believe they included so many Dragapult arts for this particular particular box set. Let's go though. Uh, if you guys want to see the pulls we got out of the Crobat one, I'll leave it linked down below. We got a Rainbow Rare, we got some full arts, so we got some pretty good pulls. So we're going to see today which box is better, Crobat or Dragapult VMAX by opening this one right now. Let's get this W starting off with the Fire Energy because we're on the hunt for that majestic majestic chunky beautiful charizard v max let's get it fire energy gym trainer tropius the wacky we got cacnea nickets buizel more peko with snubble and i think rookie d in the background we got a eevee reshiram amazing rare and can we get a little baby god pack nah amazing rare reshiram for our first pack of the day let's just get some zoom in action right there appreciate the reshiram Ooh, it looks slightly thicker on the left to right but regardless this card looks phenomenal and there's no hollow bleed oh man the very first Ch Shining Fates boxes we, we opened up, those Pikachu V collections. There was a lot of defects in like hollow bleeds on those packs. So we're starting off with the Rush Ram. We're going to cover the Crobat VMAX. Next up, let's get to yet again another uh, Dragapult. Dragapult art right here. Man, first pack magic. What a great way to start off today's video. We got four to the back and let's go. Psychic Energy. We got Tropius. Eldegoss, Rotom, we got Kofin Vivit. It's not in focus. Why are we not in focus? Come on, y'all. Come on, camera. <clears throat> there we go. Kofin is now in focus. We got more Peko. We got Yanma, Horsey, Shinx, Luxio. We'll get a Luxray in the back. And no. Ooh, a Crobat VMAX. I thought we got something else. Nice. Crobat VMAX. So that's two packs in a row where we got some heat. And now I can show you guys Crobat VMAX and Shiny Crobat VMAX side by side. Take a look at that. That's cool. See this, you can tell like the colors are different. It's like from purple to pink and blue to lime green. So I appreciate when Pokemon actually does a proper shiny Pokemon, but this is just the regular VMAX that we pulled. And then let's do an Unbroken Bonds right now before we get back to our regular scheduled Shining VMAX. Maybe we can pull a Charizard Reshiram out of this. Imagine we pull Reshiram and Charizard Reshiram in the same video. That would be really, really cool. So four to the front, four Unbroken Bonds. One of my favorite tag team sets out there. We got a Psychic Energy. We got Fairy Charm Ability, Chip Chip Ice Axe. We got Tyrogue NK, Caterpie, Clefairy, Poliwag, Ekans, Squirtle Reverse Hollow. That's a really good Reverse Hollow. I love Squirtle. This is gonna go in the binder. And <gasps> yes, a GX, a Cel a Celesteela GX. I am not familiar with this Pokemon at all. I'm not even gonna front. It's an Ultra Beast. So it's basically a Digimon. So we pulled a Digimon GX card for our, our Unbroken Bonds. The centering is awful, look at that. There's like almost no border on the bottom, but the top is vibing. So Celesteela GX is our first uh, first GX card. And we're not gonna really pull too many GX cards because Shining Fates has V cards. The uh, GX cards were phased out once they introduced Sword and Shield. So let's get to our next pack of the day. Four to the back. Let's get this W, guys. Let's go, Psychic energy you gotta get in like the right stance so i don't get my finger in in focus i have to make sure the cards are just in focus all right here we go we just dropped it cramorant we got a tropius let's get some zoom in action we got tropius right here we got ball guy yanma horsey shinx spinarak a grookey eevee reverse hollow and is a decidui rare hollow not the cards we want but it is a solid card for competitive play all right we have one more dragapult v max pack left to go for today's opening and then we have the other shining fates to go without dragapult on the front without him on the front our mascot for today we got a water energy all guy tropius eldegoss eevee choodle cacnea gossiflor Coughing, 
Ooh, Choodle Reverse Hollow and a Professor's Research, which by the way, they are releasing Pokemon Go trading cards. Yes, Professor Willow, I believe is his name from Pokemon Go. We'll do a Unbroken Bonds right now as we talk about this. Professor Willow from Pokemon Go is going to be introduced into the Pokemon trading card game. I have a news video covering it. So if you guys wanna watch that news video, check it out, but it's gonna be the first of a few uh, Pokemon Go themed cards in the trading card game. And that's because Pokemon Go turns five years old this year. Wow, Pokemon Go is five years old. That's crazy, man. So yeah, we have the news video on the channel. If you guys wanna stay up to date on your Pokemon news, we cover lots of news on the channel. Tenacruel, Cottony, we got an Ekans, Carvana, Litten with this kind of art. We got Clefairy, Agron, Reverse, Rare, Hollow, and a poly rat let's get back to our main attraction for today's video all righty oh let's i really i really want to get a shiny we haven't pulled a shiny in today's video yet we got reshiram and that was our only hit oh no we got we got crowbat vmax but we don't have a shiny pokemon yet rusted sword we got a rotom dartrix coughing shinx spinarak buizel we got kufant Snom Reverse Hollow and a Frost Moth. So we got that's really nice though. That, that'll be easy to sell on eBay if we sell these Snom and Frost Moth back to back hollows. All right, what else we got? We got I have cards covering all the packs on my Marnie playmat. It's kind of disorganized. Three more packs remaining, guys. If you guys are enjoying these videos, of course, hit that like button down below. Let's do an Unbroken Bonds and we'll do the two final Shining Fates. I really want this Charizard though. We got the Reshiram. We got the Reshiram as our Amazing Rare. Ooh, you know what would be sick? If they did Amazing Rare Kanto Starters. An Amazing Rare Blastoise, Amazing Rare Venusaur, Amazing Rare... Whoa, my music just started. Let's not get copyrighted. Amazing Rare Venusaur, all, all of them. That'd be so cool. Um, but right now, I think they're really focusing on just like legendary Pokemon for the most part. Unbroken Bonds, final Unbroken Bonds pack for the day. Water Energy, Triple Acceleration Energy, Tentacruel, we got a stealthy nun hood right here. Sand Dial, Meowth. Oh, that's so cute. He's playing with the substitutes. We got a Grubbin, Clay version, Geodude, a Litten, a Landorus. I swear they have three different arts for Litten. Oh, no, no, we did a team up earlier in a different video. I've seen a lot of Littens today. Landorus Reverse Hollow Rare. Nice, Reverse Rare Hollow. Love to see it. And a Mew. Wow. Not, a, not an amazing pull, but Mew Hollow. Let's go. Mew is one of my favorite Pokemon in the game. Let's get a little zoom in action right here for Mew. Give him some respect, some appreciation. Two more packs of Shining Fates. We got Charizard and Toxtricity. So let's do Toxtricity first, and then we will finish it up with that Charizard. Again, don't forget to answer the common question of the day. Which Pokemon do you guys prefer? Do you prefer Crobat or Dragapult? I'm more of a Dragapult guy and I gave you guys my reasoning, but Crobat is still pretty, pretty cool. It's a pretty cool guy. Way cooler than Zubat. Nobody likes Zubat. Team Yell Towel. We got Floatzel, Gym Trainer. Let me just get that in focus. There we go. Gym Trainer, Kufant. We got Snom, Yanma, Gossiflor, Eevee. Oop, I pulled two. Oh, there we go. Galarian Farfetch, finally a shiny Pokemon in our Shining Fates packs. And we got Professor Juniper in the back. We'll throw her down because we got Galarian Farfetch. Oh, he looks so cool. Dude, Galarian, uh, what's his name? Galarian, oh, I forgot his name. No, Surfetch. Galarian Surfetch, is that it? He looks so cool. Uh, the homie Chad with a J pulled him in a recent live stream. This is awesome. Galarian Farfetch. He looks so badass and like that celery or whatever that is looks really, really cool. Oh no, I can see a little bit of hollow bleed. You guys can see that in the in the top right there? No, no, you hate to see it, but still that's awesome. That is that's a good pull. That is a good pull to get. All right, guys, we got one more pack left of Shining Face. Bless me your positive energy for the final pack out of this Charizard right here. Let's see if we can get a fat, fat W. And a fat Charizard, a, f a thick boy. We need a thick, a thick boy, a thick boy, like a Samboda. All right, let's 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 get this. Let's freaking go. I don't know, my ownish pranks just came out of me right there. We got a Psychic Energy for the last pack. 
Let me just make sure the camera's in focus. There, oh, it wants to focus on my thumb. This is sneaker talk TCG, not sneaker talk thumb. All right, here we go. Psychic energy, gym trainer, Aldegas. We got a Dartrix, Horsey, Coughing, Shinx, a Spinarak, Buizel. I think the next one is gonna be the shiny vault side. Ooh, Arokuda. Arokuda is like the magic carp. It's like the magic carp of the gather region. But he is a little intimidating. There's some good cards. And a boss's orders. I think one of our only boss's orders that we pulled. So shiny Arakuda is our last nice pull for today's video. If you guys made it to the end, hit that like button, subscribe for more videos. We're still a small, small channel on the Pokemon world of things for Pokemon cards. So if you guys wanna help us grow, subscribe, notification gang, all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, I'm Team Dragapult. I'll catch you guys in my jumbo Pokemon card collection video or another upcoming uh, video where I open up all the Pokeballs that just came out this spring season. Until then, peace out.